Thomas and Friends, Thomas Goes Fishing, based on the railway series by the Reverend W. Audrey. When Thomas puffed along his branch line, he always looked forward to something special. The sight of the river. As he, as he rumbled over the bridge, bridge, he can see people fishing. Thomas wanted to stay here and watch, but his driver said, No, what was the type of man that he would relate? Every time he met another engine who said, I want to fish. But they all had the same, same answer. Engine don't go fishing. Silly stick in the mud, stopped Thomas. One day he, he is waiting wait, wait station, wait in the station to take a water by the river. Out of order. Bother, said Thomas. I'm thirsty. Never mind, said his driver. We get some water from the river. They found a bucket and some rope and ran to the bridge. Then the driver let the bucket down to the water. The bucket was old and had five holes, so they had to pull it up and enter Thomas' boiler as, boiler as quickly as they could, several times over. They filled, they filled it up at last. That's good, that's good, huffed Thomas, and Annie and Clever hap, happily went happily behind. Just then, Thomas feel a little pain on his boiler. Steam was well, hushing the safety bell in an alarming way. There's too much steam, said his driver. Oh dear, said Thomas. I'm going to burst. I'm going to burst. They tapped out this fire and kept going. I got such a pain. I got such a pain, Thomas hissed. When Thomas reached the last station, uncouple Andy Clubbo and and poor Thomas on the siding right out of the way. The driver called the inspector, and the and the workman placed the sign to, to back on the front, back on the front. Danger! Keep away! Soon the inspector and the top man showed up. Cheer up, Thomas, they said. We'll soon put you right. The driver told me what had happened. So the feed ply was blocked, said the inspector. I'll just look in the tanks. Then he looked down. Then he climbed down. Excuse me, sir. Please tell me what you see. He said to Sir Top Man. Certainly, Inspector. Said Sir Top Man. Then to Sir Top Man looked, climbed up, and nearly fell in surprise. Inspector, he whispered, "Can you see fish?" Gracious goodness me, how did the fish get there, driver? We must use them water with our bucket, says Thomas' driver. Well, Thomas, so you and your driver have been fishing, but fish don't suit you. We must get them out. They all took turns fishing at Thomas' tank, while Sir Topman told him, told him and how to do it. When he cut all the fish, they have a lovely picnic supper of fish and chips. Mmm... That was good, said Sir Topham Hat. But fish don't shoot you, Thomas, so you mustn't do it again, he said. No, sir, I wouldn't. Engine don't go fishing. It's too uncomfortable.